Hi there, I'm Jonathan Herrera, and I wanted to make a quick video to introduce you to the new course I'm teaching at the California Jazz Conservatory starting September 18th and running for 10 weeks. It's called 21st Century Bass, and my concept with this class was to do a primer on effects and synthesis, especially as they relate to bass players, although instrumentalists of all types might find something useful in this class. I'll go step by step through all of the different categories of effects from distortion, to pitch shifting, to modulation, to time-based effects, and then we'll explore analog synthesis and how to cop the great sounds we all know and love from people like Stevie Wonder, Bernie Worrell, and so many more great key bass performers. I know the motivation for me to do this course is to share the excitement I found when I began to really explore the sonic manipulation that was available to me through outboard effects and through synthesizers. Not only did it have a positive benefit on my career, opening me up to a whole bunch of new opportunities, it also was a source of inspiration. I've been playing the bass for a very long time, I think about 25 years now, and it's exciting to realize, wow, there's this whole area of exploration that I haven't um, taken the time to explore, and it invigorated my playing a lot, and I'm sure it'll be the same for you. Uh, a little bit about me, I'm the former editor-in-chief of Bass Player Magazine, and a current senior contributing editor to the magazine. I've had a long and diverse career in music playing with a variety of people, which you can see in my biography on the website. I won't go through it now. Um, I'm also someone that in recent time has spent maybe about half of my gigging life playing synthesizers or playing bass guitar incorporating effects. Part of the reason for that is because, as I'm sure you know, popular music generally has moved in a more electronic direction. As technology develops, music is a reflection of that technology. And if you have any interest in sort of staying relevant and being capable of playing the kinds of sounds that you're hearing on the radio, it's gonna be a necessity sometimes to in integrate effects into your setup. So I think this class has a lot to offer uh, for a weekend warrior or a professional. Either way, I think it'll, it'll be a source of a lot of joy and inspiration.